All right, so we acquired this mobile home. It was a rental. Uh, same guy lived in it for many, many years. And uh, I guess he was, you know, not the, I don't know. He, he, there's a lot of stuff in here. We have to move out, get it cleaned up. Uh, a lot of crap. And uh, we're going to get it cleaned up, see what we have to deal with. Um, I'm not sure what yet we're going to do, but it's a task. And now you know what I know. Um, we're going to go ahead and get started. All right, here it is. This is a mobile home that we have acquired. And uh, we're getting in here and we're getting ready to gut it and clean it out. We got our dumpster delivered. We've already started getting a little bit of stuff thrown in here. We'll take a quick walk around the outside. Got a porch that needs some work. The whole damn thing needs some work. This whole house just needs to be worked on. Okay, we got an addition back here, probably not built very well. What we got here, a door, something. Oh, yay. Look at the garbage. Don't know what I'm in for, but it's a mess. Uh, we're going to continue walking around this and look at the rest of it. All right. I uh, don't know what this is. It's moss or mold or I don't even know. Mildew, maybe. Okay, wow. This window's busted out. Back door is open. Okay. Well, let's check it out. All right, here we go. Not much in here. Just a bunch of junk, clothes, cat box, it's dark in here, ooh dark, we have no light, okay. Here's the living room, really tiny, but lots and lots of stuff. Really, really dated. Well, we're going to get in here and get everything cleaned up, get everything moved out.
this is what was under the couch. you see all the sand that's in this rug that's just look at that look at that yeah. <laughs> this is about 70 pounds it should be about 15 all that sand. What you breathing so heavy for? <laughs> you tore that thing up dirt up off that floor. I want you to look at this sand. We got a beach going on here. Look at that. <laughs> I told you, dude. You got a beach <laughs> in Central Florida. Now we're going to work our way back this way, but this is such a small opening, I can't move anything out of there, uh, or it's going to be hard to move it out. We're going to tear this out anyway, so I'm going to take this wall out so we can get this refrigerator moved, and then we'll have a clear shot to go through. That's my story, and I'm sticking to it. head on that way as soon as they get this refrigerator out of the way.
You ain't throwing that away, are you? Huh? I said you ain't throwing that away, are you? No, no, I just you know, brand new. Uh, I'm gonna plug it in on that outlet over there, though. It's got, and it's got some frozen food and stuff in it. This is one day. It is full. Over full, really. But uh, that's what you do. Okay, well, we have pretty well, well we cleaned all we can clean up out of here. Um, there are still, you can see there's still lots of stuff, lots of stuff. The cabinets are emptied for the most part. We've got to go through all this from the previous tenant. Some of it is going to be sent to his family. Um, anything of value. Going down this narrow hallway, it's only about 28 inches wide. Back into this room here. This room was practically full, but we've cleaned it out. Um, you can see that electric system there is in really bad shape. We're gonna have to do something serious to fix that. That's an old hamster terrarium looks like, or a snake. Don't know. Uh, we've got a karaoke machine and a fishing pole. We'll give that to them in the bathroom couldn't get in the cabinet so we tore the doors off tore the door off of here so we could get in there but you can see it's a lot of really bad stuff these are the things that you get the toilet looks like it's falling through the floor we'll go through here there's a door here this is off the hallway it is sort of a laundry area with some storage it's, it's not going to end up this way but uh, because there's just entirely too much crap there's not nearly enough room in this place uh, we'll go into the back room. This was so dungy and dark because they had black plastic over the windows, but we've taken that down and uh, This air conditioner works the air conditioner up front works But those didn't belong to the tenant those belonged to the owner uh, We've cleaned everything out. There was a bed here um, All the clothes we box up all the clothes for the tenant cleaned out the closet and uh, we're going to send them over to the veterans home where he is now living. But then we come back down to the hallway. And this goes back into the kitchen. Which we're going to be cleaning this up. 
and this air conditioner here works as well which also uh, belong to the owner not the tenant um, and there's a lot of stuff back here that we're going to uh, that we've salvaged out of here we're going to be going through and making sure the tenant has but uh, the furniture did not belong to the tenant it belonged to the house uh, but we bagged up his clothing and uh, all of his personal papers and books here uh, and those are car seats out of his car so we're going to see that he gets those back and with that we're going to conclude the task for the day um, so you know i'm going to be uploading this to today the day that we actually did everything uh, I'm not going to do a lot of editing on it because there's not really a lot to edit. It, it is what it is. But uh, this house is going to need a lot of work. You can see the ceilings are in bad shape. The walls are in bad shape. The floor is in bad shape. Uh, all these cabinets got to go. Uh, this is, this, this, I measured it as 10 foot wide, 52 feet long. So it's 520 square feet plus a 12 by 16 addition on the back. So, you know, not a lot of, uh, not a lot of room. But with that, we're gonna call this one a wrap. And uh, I don't know if we'll get back on this one before we get back over on the $6,000 house. But uh, I had to get through here and get all this stuff picked up and cleaned up and sorted through so I could get it off to the uh, veterans home for the tenant or the previous tenant and uh, get everything cleaned up and now you know what it's like when you get involved in this in the very beginning so you have a good day hit that like button hit that subscribe button and come back and see me